Hello, friend Mormo here. I just got done with my schoolwork today. I had to write a report about four filmmakers and what they do on social media and stuff. And uh, so I wrote that report and it was really challenging and hard. So now I'm gonna take it easy and watch a movie on trauma now. And uh, so you can see here's my TV. There's trauma now. And uh, there it is. And I love Troma now. I always see good movies on Troma now. Divide and Conquer, that's the movie I want to see. New This Month, Blood Panther, that sounds awesome. Night of the Living Dead, I've already seen that. I reviewed it like a long time ago, actually. Reunion of Champions. Bobo Touch Helpline. Could I Kiss You? And I don't know if these are shorts or if they're feature length movies, but these are all new this year. That's pretty wild. Or new this month, rather. But I'm going to watch this movie, Divide and Conquer. Meanwhile, in Tromaville, three women warriors find themselves on the run and kicking in the teeth of every misogynist that dares to cross their path. Lloyd Kaufman calls it a feminist movie for the 21st century. The estrogen-fueled grindhouse tribute is written, slash directed and co-starring Mercedes the Muse, and I'm friends with her on Twitter. And, uh... Okay, let's start watching. Stick around. Oh no. Darn it, I'm uh. It says I'm not subscribed. Okay, let's log in. Okay, I'll figure it out. Anyways, stick around. I'm going to give you my review of um, Divide and Conquer. I'm really excited to see this. I've seen a trailer already, and it looks really good. I just have to enter a four-digit code at the website, and then I can get my... Um, my uh, subscription reactivated because I'm pretty sure I am subscribed to Troma. Roku's like that every once in a while. You have to update your account and stuff. Anyway, stick around. I'll be right back to tell you what I thought of Divide and Conquer. Hello, friend Mormo here. I finished the movie. I uh, It only took a couple minutes to figure out getting my logging into Troma now on Roku. I just had to go to their website and then put in my email and then click a link in the email. And then I had to punch in a code and then press enter or something, but I got in anyways. And uh, this was a great movie. I would consider it just as good as like Toxic Avenger 4 or the new Return to Classum class of Newcomb High it's like fits right in with kind of the gross out direction that Troma took and uh, of like gross out anti movie or whatever but what I was really impressed with by this movie is that it works as a science fiction movie it's like it's like it takes place in the future or in another dimension or something but um they there was really smart filmmaking that made this movie like i say it just really worked as a science fiction type story or almost like um yeah and this movie was very offensive and um it had a lot of female nudity a lot of simulated male nudity 
and uh, even some stuff, even some stuff uh, like uh, werewolf sex and stuff like that. Oh, I just gave away a big spoiler, sorry, but like, this movie is just like all over the place, and uh, it's uh, really good. I really enjoyed it. I thought it was really well made. I'd love to know more about it. I, hopefully, there'll be a director's commentary one day. Um, I don't really buy physical media that much anymore, but I'd love to hear a director's commentary. And uh, it's basically like the story of these three women who call themselves gynos, which is like the a trauma term. There's all kinds of like trauma references and trauma in jokes and stuff in this movie and um it's these three women and they're kind of like in this gang and there's this like uh german like white supremacist gang that's chasing after them and they they're traveling all over and then they go to traumaville and uh, just tons of like nudity and just women in bikinis and with their boobs hanging out and stuff and uh, really good looking women and um, the movie was really funny I laughed out loud a couple times and uh, it was you know like the older I get the less I want to watch the gross out stuff but uh, I still watch it and uh it's just like i'm just like not as into it as i used to be but like i don't like 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 i'm i'm trying to be offensive to this movie because i really did enjoy it but i've always been more of a fan of the trauma stuff that's like not an anti movie and not gross out and it's like i guess in a way i've kind of been a fan of the pickup films a lot more I don't know I'm I don't know like uh, I'm, I'm I'm just not a fan of the gross out stuff like I used to be and uh, but I highly recommend this movie uh, I hope it makes a lot of money and um, it should lead to a great career for Mercedes the Muse she did an excellent job making this movie like it was just really well made there was like ideas in this movie I'm not going to give them away but there was things I thought of that like oh man I should do that in my movie to make my movie look better Just I'm just eating grapes right now but um, it was just a really good movie and uh, I highly recommend it. It's totally worth it to subscribe to Troma now. You saw how much stuff they had on there for this month. Like we looked at not even all of it, but like a, a chunk of the what's new this month on Troma now. And Divide and Conquer was a great movie. Easily worth five bucks a month to see that. And um, there's like a... You can also get your first month free on Troma now. So if you haven't subscribed yet, you might think about subscribing and cashing in on that free month to see this um, Troma Now movie that's like Divide and Conquer and uh, <sighs> it's really awesome and it's got like a lot of beautiful women in it and it's really well made and uh it's just a good sci-fi movie that was what that's what i really liked that was my favorite thing about this movie is that it, it was probably lower budget i'm sure it had a low budget 
but it, it just was very effective as a science fiction movie and uh, thanks so much for watching I'm going to put this on my horror cash channel because it would probably get like flagged on my partner channel so please comment thumbs up subscribe ring the bell share because sharing is caring and thanks so much check out divide and conquer on trauma now i give it five out of five and uh definitely check it out <laughs>